Hello everybody, my name is Tubus Fly, and it is very dark and whatever outside. Um, joined by drum set or Bosch. Hey, what's up? So we just got out of seeing Captain Marvel. Whoops, I keep putting my thumb over the camera. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is just going to be thoughts, reactions kind of thing for Captain Marvel. So there will be probably Jeopardy song playing right now. Okay, so, I don't know, uh, obviously it was a good movie, otherwise we wouldn't have seen it, and I know the dramatic lighting is very, the lighting is very dramatic here from, you can see my face here to not there, and so on and so forth, it's really distracting to me, um, yeah, I mean, overall it's just a good movie, you know, Marvel doesn't disappoint whatsoever, um, no complaints, it really throws... Not really it throws a timeline for a loop, because obviously it's a prequel. Um, it was really good, I thought. Because <laughs> it was supposed to be 1990s, right? Yeah, at one yeah, point... Yeah, 1990s. Yeah, at one point Nick Fury said uh, that the accident that got Marvel had was six years ago, and mm -hmm. that was 89, so that made it 1995. Yeah. Uh, which... If I'm not mistaken, would be the second, second earliest besides the first Captain America movie. Get my thumb out of the shot, because <laughs> he's like World War One ish or two. No, I thought Cold War. They said Cold War for Captain Marvel. No, or I'm sorry for Captain America. Oh, Captain America. No, he's World War Two. Yeah, he's World War Two. Yeah, because the Nazis because of uh, uh, Hydra. Yeah. Uh, what's his name? Red Skull? Red Skull. Yeah, yeah. Red Skull. Um, so, yeah. But, I think, like, if I had to describe this movie probably in one word, it would be twists. Because yep. there was so much. My favorite character in this movie has to be the cat. There's a cat named Goose. And... <laughs> you could... You could yeah. <laughs> there... So, when, like... Like, when I say twist, I mean, like, the Kree are who they say they are. No. Um, they're the bad guys in this whole scenario. Imagine that. But. By the way, spoiler alert. <laughs> I mean, that's what the whole Jeopardy yeah. bit at oh, the beginning okay. was. But um, the Kree, <laughs> or um, whoever the, the guy was that was fighting her and kind of putting her, putting her under his wing... Um, like, the fact that then he called up on his communicator thing, Ronan the Executioner, and that's like, what just happened? <laughs> Roland was in Guardians, right? Yeah, he was right. the main villain in Guardians 1, but he... Wait, what was the force that they were being controlled by that they had all the... I know it's not um, Dormammu from Doctor Strange, but didn't weren't they being possessed that they got, like... Like bloodshot, kind of purple lines coming out of their eyes. I think so. I don't know what that was. Unless, wait. Oh, that was because they were. Oh, because they were being possessed by the Power Stone or something like that. Yeah. Um, whatever the purple one is, I don't I know, know the, the names. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm a bad Marvel fan, but. Um, it's better than DC. <laughs> <laughs> No, after, after good, Justice League, there's some good DC movies out though. Wonder Woman, Aquaman. Wonder Woman, yeah, Aquaman was good. I felt like Justice League was in the yeah. in the middle. Um, it wasn't bad. It wasn't good, no. but I think it was okay. No, the best DC movie is Lego Batman. <laughs> oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, but what Bojan was referring to earlier was. Uh, Goose. <laughs> I think it was intentional. I don't know, but there was a jump scare with Goose when you first find out that he's not your uh, typical, typ typical cat. astro yeah. cat. 
Uh, <laughs> he made me jump scare. Probably cracked him up, but uh, <laughs> boy, no, the part where you just jumped was funny. Yeah, I, I was just like, really, what? I was just so disturbed. I'm just like paying attention to what's happening, and all of a sudden, Goose is like eating people. I'm like, um, what? Okay. Um, then otherwise, I feel like. Not to say that this was a coming, uh, not to say that this was like a coming of age movie, but I kind of, it had that feel, mm -hmm. because she's trying to piece together her past yeah. and then moving on mm -hmm. so forth. So she's bringing the piece together. <laughs> yeah. No, now that we know that, yeah, the Cree yeah. or no, the Kree, yeah, the Cree are evil. The Scroll mm -hmm. aren't. Um, yeah, when they hit that moment like i said yeah. to Bosch that there was a theory i don't know if anybody else has heard of it i've heard it there's a theory back at the first or second end game trailer with uh ant-man coming out uh on the security feed at avengers tower and he's like hey guys let me in <laughs> um there's a theory going around that that was a scroll but apparently that's obviously not the case or maybe if it is it could be a rogue scroll who knows for sure yet until the movie comes out in about a month from now yeah and then shazam comes next do you see right or one of the i don't I know shazam's next it's, uh, yeah i think shazam's yeah. for it's next week or two weeks but you said that was the original yeah shazam yeah. in the according to the comics or not according to the comics in comics history um, Shazam was the original Captain mm -hmm. Marvel, and then there's videos about it. I know I saw it mm -hmm. fairly recently, I believe, from probably What Culture. That's all I ever watch is What Culture. But, um, yeah, overall, Captain Marvel was good. Yeah. Um, looking forward to what happens in Endgame as much as everyone else is yeah. in the entire world, so. Uh,. Mm -hmm. My favorite pizza place. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, I guess like any final thoughts before we sign off? No, nah, it was it was good. Um, can we name all the Marvel movies right now? Can you remember them from order from like ten In, years ago? Oh so God. I know Iron Man is first. Yeah, Iron Man. And then I think Hulk. Thor. No, Hulk. Yeah, yeah, Hulk. Hulk. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> Ten years of movies. This, this is not going to end well. I mean, I mean no. Up. You said from memory. Okay, from memory. You said from memory. All right. Sheet. So Iron Man. Which Hulk are we talking about? The no. one that's not Mark Ruffalo. Okay. Okay. <laughs> the I, one, the one with the original guy, and then he's like, "Oh, I didn't realize this was yeah. a ten-year plus commitment." Oh yeah. And signed <laughs> off on the series. So, so Iron Man was two thousand eight. 2009 yeah. it might have been Hulk or Thor. I think it was probably Hulk and then I think Thor, Thor came later then yeah. probably Iron Man no. 2. No? No I think uh, I honestly uh, have Captain no clue. Martha came before Iron Man. I know Avengers 1 came out in 2012. Yeah. So they had four years to build it. Since universe. we can't have it memorized <laughs> leave a comment down below in the comment section what Marvel do you think? What? Yeah. yeah, whatever the order yeah, is. I'm just more said. concerned about, like, the the chronological yeah. timeline. Yeah, I'm more worried said. about that. Yeah, me too. Because <laughs> obviously it goes He's Captain... It goes, his channel. it goes Captain America, then Captain Marvel, and then I don't know where after I that. I don't know either. And I found at um, one point a website that had the timeline. Marvel, I believe, also has not yet fully confirmed the yeah. timeline, mm -hmm. but... We can all just speculate and have a good time with it. I think otherwise from probably the events of, of Iron Man 1, it probably just goes chronologically from there, yeah. I would suspect. Unless Guardians takes place before that, but I... Guardians? Who, who is to really say, but... I don't know what But, uh... Guardians 2 takes place right before Avengers Infinity War. Obviously. Because, oh, yeah, because yeah, well, yeah. they talk about his father, about how he killed his father in the Avengers. 
In Infinity War? Yeah. I yeah, don't yeah. remember. They, uh, yeah, Chris Pratt's character did talk about. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I don't remember. Okay, I, yeah, that's all <laughs> I, I know. I don't that. remember, so. No, it's okay. Hopefully for the future, <laughs> after Endgame, I'm thinking, I know I need to wrap this up. Hopefully after Endgame, I'm hoping that they'll do Nova, because I, I think from Guardians 1, they kind of botched Nova Core. Um, and I, and I think it's still being rumored or in the works that Black Widow's getting a spinoff or getting her own solo movie. How about Nick Fury? Is Nick Fury getting a movie? I don't think so. I would not mind it. Oh, that's also the other thing. Um, like Infinity War, it didn't feel like an Avengers movie. It felt like a Thanos movie. And, and, I, and I don't have a problem with that. And I feel like with Captain Marvel, it was more... Is split between Nick Fury mm -hmm. and Captain Marvel because they both kind of get their own origin yeah. story per se. They didn't give him his eye patch in this. Movie. No, but they alluded to it. Yeah, kind of. they did. Yeah, they did. Because <laughs> um, Goose, uh, again, he's yeah. an extraterrestrial cat. Mm -hmm. He scratches uh, Fury's face. Um, that's what leads to the eye patch. Yeah. So who too. knew? Yeah. Who knew? Um. <laughs> Yeah, because we're going on about ten and a half minutes here, and oh, probably okay. kill my memory so, yeah. <laughs> on my phone. So um, that's probably going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave me your thoughts and reactions in the comments below of Captain Marvel. And then otherwise, we'll probably do this again, probably for Shazam. Yeah. Yeah. And Avengers too, right? Yeah. Whenever, yeah. like after this, because this is the first movie. First oh. video like this. Yay, what am I talking one. about? <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Again, like, share, subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell notification button and all that good stuff. So, thank you everybody so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys next time.